In today's tutorial I'm going to talk about the modes of the major scale. I'm going to refer to C major to start with because it's the simplest way to inform you of the scales. I'm going to play the scale of C major. That is a scale of C major or could be called the Ionian mode which is the first mode. The second scale or mode, mode is really just a name for a scale, the second mode of the C major scale is D Dorian and that is I just played the notes D to D with basically the key signature of C major, so no sharps, no flats, and that's what I'm going to continue to do. E Phrygian would be E to E, F, F to F, and so on. But it's much easier to think about what the mode is. What is the mode? Is it major? Is it minor? What's specific to that mode? So if we started with the Ionian mode, which is ba the basic major scale, the chord that would fit it, the harmony, would be a major seventh chord. If we went to the Dorian mode, that's a minor mode, so it has a minor third and a flattened seventh, the chord that would fit that would be D minor seven, which sounds like this. And you've probably heard that in pieces like So What? Those are called the So What voicings. And if you play on the Dorian mode, improvising, it fits that. The next mode is called the Phrygian mode. And in C major, that's E to E. Or the, the, the parent scale is C major. I'm going to play a Phrygian voicing. That voicing emphasises the flat 2, the flat 2 being E to F. A bit like the Pink Panther theme has that. And that would be a scale that's a minor, a minor sounding mode, so it has a minor third, but it has that flat 2, which is very unusual for a scale. Normally there's a tone between the first and the second note. The fourth mode is called the Lydian mode and a scale from F to F. I'm going to play F major 7. It's actually F major 7 sharp 11 which sounds like this. But when we refer to it in the scale we just say it's got a sharp 4. So here's how it would sound. The next mode is called the Mixolydian mode and a good chord to go with that would be the dominant 7th chord or G7. That's used in a lot of blues. Okay, the next one is the sixth mode, and this is called the Aeolian mode. And this is very similar to the Dorian mode, so it's a minor mode, but the sixth is flattened. The sixth is the F. The last mode is called the Locrian mode, and that uh, fits a chord of a minor 7 with a flat 5. So this sounds like this. And that's often used in conjunction in functional harmony, so you often hear it as chord 2, so it'd be... So the Locrian mode fits that chord. That's quite an unusual mode because that has a minor second at the beginning, like the Phrygian. Also has a flat five. It's a minor one, so it has a minor third, and it has a minor seven. Those are the modes of the major scale. Just another way to think about it is also it's like a mathematical formula. So a major scale is a series of tone, tone, well I'll go for the first note, so first note to the second note, tone, tone, semitone, 
tone, 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 semitone. And if you see that as a like a mathematical formula, each mode shifts along. So the next mode would be tone, semitone, tone, 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 semitone, tone. I'll do one more. The third would be semitone, tone, 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 semitone, tone, tone. So it's just the intervals are, are moving along. But I think the best way personally to think of each of the mode as having a specific sound is it major? Does it have a major third or a minor third? Has it got a flat seven? Or how can I use it? What sort of chords would it go with? So maybe experiment, try dominant seventh chords with the mixolydian, mi mixolydian mode, try minor chords with the Dorian mode, try major seventh chords, try it with the Ionian, which is the major scale, but also the Lydian's really useful. In fact, I would say a lot of jazz pe pe pieces use the Lydian more than they use the Ionian, which is the normal major scale. And have fun. <laughs>